Hi, today I want to share with you a couple of tips on how to deal with language issues in PowerPoint. First of all, what we can do in PowerPoint in terms of language is display language. Now I have English version of it opened, but sometimes I have to switch to a Polish version as I conduct many presentations workshops for my Polish clients. So what do I do? I go to File tab, Options, Language section, and here I select Polish and click Set as Preferred, and the same in the lower window. I'm not sure what this upper and bottom option differ, so just to be sure it's right, I change both of them. Then PowerPoint says that if I want to see language changes, I need to restart my PowerPoint. So I do it. And after re-entering it, I see a Polish version of PowerPoint. All tabs and options are in Polish. OK, let's go back to English version. And here I want to show you something different. Let's suppose you want to type in something in English. OK, this is fine. But now I want to type something in Polish or any other language. You see, PowerPoint highlights these words as it thinks that it's incorrect. It's not a proper English. Of course it's not. It's Polish. But how can I fix it? How can I make PowerPoint not to highlight my proper English words? Well, it all comes to what keyboard is turned on. You see, if I go to the keyboard option here and switch to Polish, then I give a sign to PowerPoint and all the apps that are on that now I am writing in Polish. So PowerPoint will review the grammar and spelling according to the Polish language, not English or any other. Thanks to this, I can type in new Polish sentence and it won't be highlighted. But if I type English, it will be highlighted now. Once we have some text pasted in a slide and highlighted in red, we can change its language formatting here in the bottom left corner of PowerPoint. But if you want to have a clean text and no highlighting from the scratch, from the beginning, then we must remember to switch between different language keyboards before we start typing. OK, but you can say, I don't have such an option in my taskbar. I can't switch between keyboards. So let's fix this. I work in Windows, but the similar case is for Mac. Go to Settings of your operating system. Go to Time and Language. Language and Region. Yes, this is Windows, so we have to click a lot. And here you can see that I have three packs installed. It doesn't mean that I have access to all three keyboards, but only to language packs. If you only see one language in your dashboard, just click Add Language and choose the proper one. After that, click in the three dots here on the right and choose Language Options. Here you can check if you have a keyboard with this selected language installed. I see that I have my English keyboard installed. It's called United Kingdom QRT. But I go to my French package, go to language options, and here I see that I don't have any keyboard installed. So let's click Add Keyboard. I choose the French one, and it's done. I go to my PowerPoint, I switch my keyboard to French, and now I can type in French. Je dois. Oh, I'm terrible at writing in French. Let's change it to Je suis. Je suis très heureux maintenant. Or something like that. How did you like this video? Subscribe, 
click the bell and leave the comment. And if you want to improve your presentation skills further, you can try my free training on PowerPoint tips and tricks. You will find the link in the description below this video. Thank you for watching and see you soon.